cool. All right, anyways, yeah. So everyone, my name is Ruby Um, and welcome to Ding and Rampa Two: Goodbye Despair. <laughs> I am very excited to play this game. Perfect, perfect. Um, yeah. So maybe you're wondering why the heck I'm not playing the first one. I don't have the first one. I might buy it, but this was gifted to me, um, over uh, last week because of birthday. It was my birthday recently. So <laughs> one of my sweet mates decided, hey, we're going to get her uh, Danganronpa 2. And I'm like, cool. Well, mainly they asked, like, what game you want? I'm like, uh, Danganronpa 1 or 2. I don't care. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, so that's why. Um, yeah, that's why. So um, I have it up on the screen, as you can see, along with my little Super K Productions. I have it on either side. I don't have the chat up here. I... I could? Could I try doing the chat? Will the chat work is the question. Uh, isn't exactly, yeah. I, I, I know how Danganronpa 1 goes, so... I'm trying to think, should I have the chat up here? The chat's gonna be pretty distracting, I think? Hmm. I don't know, I didn't think about the chat <laughs> function. <laughs> So, um, eh, we can just keep it up potentially here for now. Yeet. Is my browser not on? Alright, so by the way, now is the time to let y'all know that, um, oh gosh, now is the time to let y'all know that if you aren't following me, please follow down below, click down below, all that good stuff. Um, you know, click down all below, follow me, hit notification if you want to know when I'm going live. I just went live a little later today because dinner ran a bit later, so all that. Go follow me on Twitter, SK8 Productions, I'm over there. Um, subscribe to the YouTube channels and all that stuff. I try to upload once a month, and that's the best I can do. <laughs> so, um, alright, I think I'll keep the chat off because I'm not sure how that's going to work. But yeah, I've got the spoiler warning. Um, I'll probably be talking about other Danganronpa series, because I know how the series goes. I haven't played it, but I've watched it, and I've watched other people play it, so it should be good. Anyways, um, I'm going to wait a little bit longer to see if anybody else is coming in. Uh, oh, someone retweeted. Did you retweet? You did retweet. <laughs> I was like, why am I getting a ton of notifications? It's because you're retweeting everything, Fedora. <laughs> I appreciate the shout out. <laughs> yes. Um, also, for those of you who do not know, I ran a poll. I got a lot of I got a lot of games over my birthday. Um, I got what was it one shot, uh, Portal One and Two, and uh, what was the third option I had on there? Oh, and this one, obviously. So I put a poll up on my Twitter to say, "Hey, which one do you want me to do?" And people are like, "Portal One," and you know. Ding and Rampa 2, and I'm like, well, you gotta vote for one because we died. So now we have the um, this one out the poll. So yeah, um, I guess while we're also doing pre-stream, um, kind of stuff, I'll get on the game in just a bit, just letting people come in as we go. Um, oh my gosh, the uh, Genshin live stream. Holy crap, was that a time? Um, all I can say is I'm just even more excited for Kasawa to come. <laughs> Genshin knows my type. They know I like sunshine with you know, sunshine characters with angst. That, that's my type. That's my character type. So <laughs> I also like music nerds. Music nerds I like a lot. But um, yeah, I'm so excited for him. Uh, I think the update drops on the eighth or something like that. Something like that. I'm not sure. I think that's when I calculated it, because you can judge off based off of the BP BP pass, and then um, uh, then you can add like a couple days onto it because there's usually a couple days buffer for it. All right, but anyways, yeah, I'm very excited for him. I'm super excited for the new region and that Inazuma tease that we got at the end. Eki, where did I put the chat? I need to scooch it up here a little bit. Transition. It's I say. <laughs> well, Scaramouche isn't planned for a while, and I think I saw some leaks saying he would be more towards the end potentially, but that's all speculation. So I could not tell you. 
But anyways, I think I'm gonna turn the chat off for now. Anyways, you, you'll have enough Scaramouche savings. Yeah, I have not guaranteed. I have um, uh, Kazuha guaranteed, so I'm very excited because I got Kuching on uh, Zhongli's banner. So, woo, go me. Anyways, yeet. So, I think we're ready to go, right? Almost? Is everybody here that's going to be here? Say hi in the chat if everything sounds okay. Hi, Monokuma running across the screen. I'm gonna try my best to, like, uh, peer off to. Oh, shoot. I poked a thing. My my laptop is. <laughs> my laptop has a touchscreen, and I often forget it does. Uh. Is there in the Moon Festival? Was? I don't know. What the emojis <laughs> Let me pull up Twitch one second. Um. Because there's no way in heck I'm gonna be able to um, watch the chat while I'm playing the game. <laughs> so y'all are just gonna have to tell me how things go. But assuming we're all ready to go and we're here, let's get on this new game. Oh, did you mess? Hey! Stop. That got louder. That got louder. I didn't mean that got to, get, to get louder. Okay. I think we got that. How did that sound? Okay, cool. Alright, so, so long as everything sounds good. Um, oh, I can click to what? That's weird. I don't want to reply. Um, I'm doing English, mainly because English is just easier for me to understand and handle. So, that's why. <laughs> I, I understand. I, English dub, it's a mix. I. Some people are really good at it, or at least make it sound really good, others don't. I'm doing it for the ease of me, so I'm going to do the English job because it's easier on me to understand and all that, so um, that's just how it's going to be. But yeah, so, alright, are we all ready? You ready to go? Yes, yes, yeah. No, it's, it's why, like, I'll try to not watch anime subbed. Because the voices sound so similar to me. So, and it's just easier to understand if I hear it as well, so. Anyways, y'all ready to go? God, there's a lot of racket downstairs. My, my, my sibling has a friend here, so. Alright. Assuming we're ready to go, let's poke it. We're doing this English. I'm also, I have a controller, so we'll see... I think I'll keep keyboard and mouse, so I apologize for any, like, loud keyboard noises. I just have horrible noise suppression. <laughs> Yeet. Ah, uh, we're gonna do kind, because I don't... I, I think it'll be good? Yeah. I'll, I'll do kind. It's good. We'll be fine. I don't want mean. I, I'm not that good at mystery. <laughs> Alright. Let's go! Woo! Be sure to tell me hey. if I have any audio adjustments that need to be done. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Are you okay? If you don't know who this man is, then you guys don't know memes. <laughs> yes, I, I, I think I'm okay. So pretty out of it. I mean... <laughs> You're kidding. <laughs> My gosh. To be honest, I'm also... No, everyone else feels the same too. Hello, um, Bryce Pappenbrook, doing his best not to sound same. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Hey, are you listening? I don't have much choice. I have the volume on, so I kind of have to keep listening. <laughs> I don't understand. Why am I here? What happened? I should try to remember that first. I began to think, disentangling the twisted knots that had formed in my mind. Think, 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 think. As I gathered the fragments of my scattered memories, I began to piece together what actually happened. That's right. I... I... Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> I mean, to be fair, he, he he sounds better than um uh Haley Joel Osment's comparison from Vanitas to Sora. God, that poor I I I wonder how he managed to do that with his voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I... Okay, I want to say that when I opened the game, I didn't expect that kind of title screen to greet me, so I was very confused. And I'm like, oh hey, this will make for a good tweet. So... <laughs> that day, it wasn't just a typical day for me. It was a day that felt truly significant. You guys are going to get some top tier voice acting. Don't expect me to do any good guy voices. I'm going to make an attempt, but I make no promises. And when that long-awaited day finally came, I felt proud in a way I can't really put into words. I felt like I had just become a part of something greater than myself. Does that make sense? Actually, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Actually, that's exactly what it was like. I was truly in a dream. Hope's Peak Academy. That place was so much more than a school to me. Kids who love to play baseball will long to join the major leagues. Kids who love to play soccer will just long to join a rep team. And ever since I was a kid, I felt the same way about Hope's Peak Academy. Hope's Peak Academy is a government-funded school for the privileged elite of society. It recruits top students from every imaginable field to inspire hope in doing so, shape the future. Whenever Hope Speak Academy is mentioned, it's only a matter of time before someone says, if you come here and manage to graduate, you're, you'll be set for life. And just so you know, that's not a joke and ex or an exaggeration at all. I think my logo is covering up. I'm gonna, hold on a second. This one, yeah. I'm gonna move that real quick. That's covering up a ton. There we go, all right. Many of the current leaders of various industries are actually alumni of the school. Well, that's basically what Hope Peak's, Hope's Peak is all about. As they say, it's truly the Academy of Hope. Hope, 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 hope. Bob Hope. <laughs> I'm, I'm having my time. We. <clears throat> there are two criteria you must meet in order to attend this school. Did that transition? Yes, it did. Okay. One, you must be a current high school student. Two, you must be the very best at what you do. Unlike other schools, there aren't any entrance exams in the, at this academy. The only way to get in is if the school scouts you itself. That's how Hope Speak Academy operates. Now, because of the talents of who are chosen, the students of Hope Peak uh, the students of Hope's Peak Academy are called Ultimates. I'm gonna stumble over you guys should know this by now, I'm gonna stumble over my own words whenever I'm reading stuff. So Oh, it's a good thing I've got a lot of water for this. But even though I'm finally going to Hope's Peak Academy, the school I desired more than anything else, the truth is, my circumstance is a little different than that of my peers. Well, I can guess I can put that aside for now. You'll find out soon enough, and it's nothing special worth talking about. I think. Anyways, I guess I should introduce myself first. I'm not so special that I have to introduce myself. And formalities are always a little embarrassing. Okay, I'm gonna say this right now. When I heard Kazuha's... Kaz, Kazuha? I think, Kazuha. They say with the ha, and then I always say Kazuha. But Kazuha, um, his voice sounded like Hajime, which is, this is Hajime. Um, his voice sounded a lot like this guy. So, obviously now that's been debunked because we figured out who was the, um... <laughs> Kazuha. <laughs> Kazuha. Um, that's been debunked because we now know who the voice actor is for him. But that was the closest I could make for the comparison. Do I just have the volume on? No, I don't. Okay, there we go. Well, this is what's expected. I guess that's how I should think about it. My name is Hajime Hinata. There's only one reason I came to Hope's Peak Academy. Because I admired Hope's Peak Academy. To me, attending Hope's Peak Academy is like being a celebrity or a superhero. In fact, instead of calling it admiration, it's more like it's always been a dream of mine. Cosmic, hello! Welcome to the stream. Glad you can make it. We're playing Danganronpa 2. We're skipping right over one. We're playing two, because that's what I have. 
<laughs> That's why to feel like a member of society, to become someone I can be proud uh, of. I always wanted to. Screen? Hi, screen. No, that's happening in game. All right. This is happening in game. Don't worry. Um, it's not my computer being a time. For that reason alone, I always wanted to. For that reason alone, I always, 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 always until now, I never want to admit, pain, admit it how painfully ordinary I really am. That's why hope. I might have admired talent individually, but I finally, forever, tried my best. Finally came true to... Huh? What is this? A door! <laughs> it's a door. Yeah, thank you. Brilliant observation, Hajime. There's a door. Yep, yeah, yeah, we're aware. Still... I need to hurry because I need to go inside this classroom. Why is this so slow? <laughs> need? What need? No, I should hurry. Bunk, bunk. Ah, the lights! <laughs> Hello! Friends! I have friends, how about that? <laughs> Alright, how does my audio sound for the music? By the way, I can adjust it later in a minute, but eh. <clears throat> Who goes there? Uh. Um, are you feeling all right? You look Sonia! Like um. Hey, could you be? You're also a freshman at this school, right? All right, I, I'm. I'm more talking about like the audio, the background, the game volume. Uh, then you're all. See for yourself. We're all freshmen too. Cool. Second only. I. <sighs> I don't know, I like V3's cast quite a bit. Not gonna, not gonna lie, but this cast is pretty good. It is pretty solid. I, I have a bias towards V3, because V3 has the best protagonist, Kaede Akamatsu. And I'm not saying that because she's the ultimate pianist. Okay, maybe I'm saying it because she's the ultimate pianist and I love her. She's also in the English dub voiced by Venti's voice actress. Mm -hmm. All right, these are the freshmen who accept who are accepted into Hope's Peak Academy, the ultimate. I assume freshmen like us have been gathered in this classroom. Gathered? <laughs> Hello, Biakya. Hey, why don't you just come inside for now? Ah, uh, yes, of course. Wait, why am I being so polite? I know they're called ultimates, but they're still high school students like me. That's right, first impressions are crucial in moments like this. I need to act more confident. Less to hide my nervousness from the others while trying my very best to act cool. I stepped inside, closed the door behind me, and sat in an open seat at the back of the classroom. <laughs> Hajime. You're so embarrassing. I feel bad for you. Pap, pap. Anyway, what just happened earlier? The door! I want to be here, and then a classroom door appeared right in front of me. As if I was drawn to it. But how did I walk into this classroom? Or how did I walk to this classroom? I'm gonna stumble over my own reading. A game that requires a lot of reading, and I just said, hey, yeah, we'll do this. I don't remember. Something's weird. Um, excuse me? What? What is it? Why are we all gathered in this classroom? No one said anything about coming here, so is there like an entrance ceremony or a homeroom happening now? Hm. Actually, we were just about to discuss that matter. <laughs> you know what? It's official now. Hajime stumbles over his words. 
Disgust? It's all clear. Well, oh, this is auto. No, stop. I put that on auto. My apologies. Well, since you are the last student to arrive, let's start the discussion. Ah! Eh, is this everyone? How do you know? <laughs> there are only 16 desks in this classroom, and this guy is the 16th student. Mukuru Ikusaba, the 16th student hidden somewhere in this academy. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to. Oh my god, that was a bad joke, but that was great. If you get it, if you've played through the first Danganronpa, you'll know. That line is just imprinted into everybody's mind at this point. <laughs> alright, alright. Uh, alright, click. Such ignorance. It's obvious if you've bothered to think about it. Mm -hmm. Ugh, you! You. <laughs> Thank you, Fedora. Thank you. Thank you for getting my reference. Which is what I would think we're going to talk about. Oh my god. I'm going to stumble over my accents. This is going to test my voice acting skills. I'm not a voice actor. I am a professional one. <sighs> we're going to attempt. Um. Oh. The reason we're all gathered in this classroom? First, I need to confirm something. Out of everyone here, is there anyone who actually remembers how they came to this classroom? Eh? We all looked around at each other. A surprised look appeared on everyone's face. Not one person raised their hand. <laughs> I see. So before you realized it, you were in this classroom. Then everyone here is in the same predicament. Very strange. No matter how you look at it, it's unnatural. Even stupid one looking even you stupid looking ones would agree, right? What's going on? It sure is strange. No one actually remembers how they came here. Hey! Hey! What do you mean stupid looking? So in other The moment words... you stepped foot in on campus, you felt a strange dizziness and now you're here and you don't know why. <laughs> that is what I experienced before I arrived here. Am I correct in assuming that's true of all of you? Every time I think about the correct that's Wait, the in English dub or Japanese dub? Because I know Krekkyo and Teruteru share the same voice actor in English. Oh. Well, I mean, it also would remind you that the same voice actor who does Krekkyo and Teruteru also voices Razor in the English dub of Genshin. <laughs> If you didn't realize that, because you don't- Yeah! <laughs> it's sad, it's very sad. Hmm. That happened to me too, but... <laughs> oh my god! Hi, Soraya! <laughs> We're playing Danganronpa 2! Uh, if you haven't played Danganronpa 1, I, you should be okay, but I'd recommend knowing it. We're just talking about everything. I'm playing this. There's one in the pole, so... Oh, eh? The Disney as well as just me? Everyone felt the same dizziness? That's weird. I am going to hate my voice. Even if it's just a coincidence, it feels too good to be true. Naturally. So you're saying it's not just a coincidence, then? Huh? Hmm? So in other words... <laughs> I never knew... <laughs> Oh my god, no, my chat has been failing to update crimes. I call crimes on this. No, I've never had a rump. <laughs> <laughs> you might like it. A lot of the, um, a few of the Genshin voice actors, um, and actresses, uh, voice in this game, so it's a time, I'll tell you. Is there a way in chat settings? No, I want to be able to. Hold on a second. Can I just. There we go! Jeez, my stream manager. There we go. Alright, so we got two viewers. Alright, cool. Sorry, I had to fix what I had on my phone. Alright, meaning we can only speculate who's responsible for this strange phenomenon. Uh, who's responsible? What is it? It feels like this is going to get even stranger. Huh? Uh, I don't know what you're so worried about, but that doesn't sound like a huge deal. Huh? 
What do you mean? So uh, what I mean is... Is... We're gonna have a crisis. I mean, it's a major, minor problem. Instead of trying to figure out why we're here, we should try to figure out why we can't leave. Ah, uh, what do you mean we can't leave? Eh? Seriously? I watched him march over to the door and try to open it, try with all his might to pull it open, but. He won't open! I can't open it! Huh? Huh? Why? A little while after I got here, I tried to leave to go. Mm. Go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm not gonna swear. I don't. Just, I don't swear on stream. So I'll. I'll. I'll use my own substitutions in this case. <laughs> Thank you for bearing with me. <sighs> but the, d d Thank you, Nekumaru. <laughs> God dang it! Can you? Can I? Uh, delete. Get out of here. I forgot to take a block. Can I block you? Ban user. I banned you, right? Yes, okay. User actions. Report. Um, where's the bot? There we go. Report. Uh, hold on a second. Thank you. <clears throat> I really need to get that bot set up. I haven't really needed to get a bot set up, but I guess I might have to after the stream. I have to double check what Sal uses. So, whoops. Alright, anyways, back to where we were going. Hey, hey! Hey, what's going on here? Jeez. Even with all my might, I couldn't open it. It'd be absolutely impossible for you all. You can't open it. Why? It's not impossible. She's right. It's impossible. Because when I went through that door, it opened normally. It wasn't locked at all. Though I don't understand what forces are at work here. Anyway. There is no denying that we have been locked inside this classroom. How's my voice acting doing? Am I doing good? There's so many characters I'm just like screeching because I can't come up with individual voices for them all. Locked inside? Thank you! <laughs> what, what do you mean? I suddenly became aware of how heavy my body felt. As though a feeling of unspe unspeakable dread began settling on my shoulders. Are we screwed? Maybe we're getting mixed up in something dangerous? This is... Oh shoot, I didn't even think of what I have to do for Nagito. Or perhaps... It doesn't make more sense than to think that this is the entrance exam? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm good. The entrance exam? You mean Hope Peak, Hope's Peak Academies? However... But, according to Hope Seek Academy, no such entrance exam exists. But... They may say that publicly, but it is possible that we, uh, But it is possible that this is actually a special entrance exam. That's wrong! Ah! You're wrong! This is not an entrance exam. What? What was that just now? Hey, bastard! Mm, hi, Fuyuhiko. You're going to be a time. Hey! Why don't you make that cute- why did you make that cutesy voice all of a sudden? Hmm. I won't dispute your blunt remarks about my weight, but that voice you just heard was not mine. Huh? Huh? Then whose is it? Um... Um, it's actually mine! <laughs> Who's there? Who are you? Perhaps... It sounds like it came from behind the teacher's desk. Behind the teacher's desk? Hello! Alright, I see. Everyone has arrived. Let's begin. <laughs> there.
<laughs> Cute bun bun. What is that? Um, it looks like a stuffed animal. That's right. I am a squeezably soft stuffed animal. Magical miracle girl Usami, aka Usami. I may not look like it, but I am your squeezably soft teacher. Nice to meet you all. <laughs> huh? huh? Am I hallucinating? Am I the only one who's seeing this? What's going on? Nah, I see it too. Huh? What's with this talking chihuahua? <gasps> That's a chihuahua? Everyone! Does everyone know what a rabbit is? It's a lovable animal that's screaming fluffy and soft. <laughs> That's what I am! A singing, dancing, talking rabbit mascot! Oh. Hold on! Let me process this first. Okie dokie! <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a time. God, there are like... There are some people who haven't even spoken yet. And I haven't come up with voices for them. I am... Oh. Jesus. <laughs> Um, um, what do you guys think? I've never seen stuff damn well that can sing Dan's talk for. Huh. It's probably some remote controlled or something. Don't act like such a jerk or... No, don't act like such a wimp over a child's toy. Hmm. Oh, Yuhika, you're going to be a time. Hmm. E even if it's a remote control, doesn't that mean it's lifelike? It doesn't it look too lifelike? That's pretty advanced for a toy. Stop talking. Its movements and mannerisms are not the issue. More importantly, based on what it just said, Come on. it seems you know something about our current situation. Leave it to me! Of course I do! I'm the lead teacher of the school trip! What did you say? School trip? Come on. Hey, what do you mean school trip? <laughs> a large group of students go on a chaperone trip with the lead teacher. It's the best event of the school year. We're not looking for such a literal answer. Ding, ding, ding. Now, let's depart for the fun school trip! D depart Did you know the whole Dang and Rampa, like the whole series soundtrack, is on Spotify? Now you know. Hmm. Alrighty. Yes, it is. Huh? I can put this on auto, I think. My veins, but my eyes too. The world just stopped making sense. The classroom collapsed like a stage set, and what appeared before me instead was... Blue sky, white clouds. Blue sea, white waves. What? What the hell is this? <laughs> no matter how I tried to rationalize it, it was abnormal. Clearly unreasonable. Utterly crazy. Blatantly wrong. Oh. Um. That was weird. But oh. oh. Stop, 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 stop. Games glitching to bit. Tiny bit. Games glitch it. Oh, I personally not, not question it. <laughs> I would question it. I mean, that would be logically what would make the most sense. <laughs> what a good. Whoa, what? Are you kidding me? This is a joke, right? Emergency! What, where are we? Why? Huh? Well, what's going on? Everyone! Everyone, please stay calm. <laughs> There's no reason to panic. See? Look around. Feast your eyes on this beautiful ocean. It's like your heart was being is being washed clean, isn't it? It washes away everything, even all the bad things. Hold on. Oh, hold on. Give us the details. Where in the world are we? Where do you ask? Well, obviously we're <laughs> out where it's better, out where it's wetter, out by the sea. 
That war is better. That war is better. Take it from me. <laughs> thank, thank you, Soraya. <laughs> I, I understand this is the sea, but what are we doing here? Um, no, your dad's gonna get hoarse if he keeps screaming like that. Something like this. But uh, we're just uh, at. We were just at school, and now we're by the sea. This is impossible. No problem. Please not worry. The school trip's just started, that's all. Hold on a sec. But like, why are we on a school trip all of a sudden? We totally skipped all the stuff that comes first. I'm trying to not screech while I'm home. Because I'm still home. <laughs> so, um, sorry if my voices aren't that loud. She, she's right. We're all supposed to be attending Hope Speak Academy. I see. Ah, Hope Speak Academy. I see, I see. You don't say. You guys are feeling unsure about Hope Speak Academy. Then, in that case, Alrighty. please forget about Hope Speak Academy. That's why we're having a school's trip in the first place. Huh? Bastard! The hell do you mean we should forget about it? Come on. Hey, why are you, what are you? Just what are you scheming? I'd be sus. Have fun making that hoagie. <laughs> so if you didn't know us already, um, <clears throat> on the left side, you can see it kind of in the corner, it's scrolling through what title song is playing, and it's got like the volume and stuff. Then on the time, you can see like the ticking thing around the sun. It's moving along with the beat. So there's something, you know? What? I'm not scheming for anything. I'm doing this for everyone's sake. I'm praying from the bottom of my heart that hope will grow within everyone's heart. Oh, stop. No I keep I keep meaning to hit space and then I realize I can't do that. I gotta click. There's nothing dangerous on this island whatsoever. So please, there's no need to worry at all. Wait. Island? Did you just say island? And it certainly is beautiful. It was prepared just for us. An island free from other people in danger. Are you saying this island is uninhabited? Could it be? Perhaps you brought us to this uninhabited island to make us kill each other? But not, not yet, Nagito. You're getting ahead of yourself. You're, you're getting ahead of yourself, buddy. Also... <laughs> <laughs> I'll get to a point, but um, Soraya, this guy is voiced by uh, Bryce Pappenbrook, and he voiced M Mag ah, Makoto in the previous game, and the contrasts are pretty much like um, Healy Joel was trying to do or between Sora and Vanitas in <laughs> Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> well, um, see. Sorry, the thing is, um, in every thing about the game, you know, he's ready to reenact the <laughs> Lord of the Flies, but, um, this, this is also typically what happens. You know, this is Danganronpa after all. <laughs> Alright. Uh, uh, what? Kill each other? Yes. Nah, no way. Bloody business. Causing violence or inflicting pain is a big no-no on this island. Even the word kill, just saying it horrifies me. Yeah, yeah so scary. What are you thinking? Then what is this school trip you mentioned? What do you intend for us to do on this island? <laughs> There's always one wing. That's true. <sighs> I forgot I had laundry downstairs. Frick. <laughs> While you all relax on this island paradise, you must get along with and strengthen your bonds with one another. That's the main rule on this heart throbbing school trip. What did you heart say? Throbbing school trip? That's right! Spend these peaceful, relaxing days nourishing hope and lazing about, free from pain, free some from suffering. Sorry, we need to be on this island. We need to be on this island after after the live stream from today. 
Truly, this lovey-dovey, heart-throbbing school trip is... <laughs> everyone's homework! What? What the hell does that mean? Now then, let the heart-throbbing school trip begin! It goes without saying, but I had no idea what she was talking about. I couldn't follow her words at all. And then, just like that, like a curtain slowly lowering. My mind ground to a halt. <laughs> I love this opening. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid. Hopefully, I won't get copyrighted for this, but I'm playing a game, so I should be okay. Hopefully. It says some, this feels like a uh, Super Mario. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's the time, let me tell ya. Welcome to Dangan Island! Yep. Teru Teru Hanamura. Ugh. Mikan Sumiki? Ah, for Yuhiko. Oh god. Reach for the stars! <laughs> Ooh, look at this cast. Dangan Island, huge panic at this heart throbbing school trip. I would like to see my current progress. Yes, thank you. Ooh, boop, boop. I love that very hey. <laughs> Can you hear me? Are you okay? So. That's Bryce Papp and Brooks, Sarah. And the contrast between night and day for this is, like I said, it sounds like Haley Joel Osment doing Sora and Vanitas. And that's Birth by Sleep Vanitas, not a. Not whatever uh, King Mars 3 has going on. <laughs> I feel bad. God, how did he do that without, like, damaging his voice? Because that's like. That's like doing like this! <coughs> no, no way. Can't do that. Ah, uh, that'll hurt my voice. Too much. <laughs> That's what I was <laughs> yes. Not that one. Not that one. Birth by sleep. Birth by sleep. The the one that sounds like suitably better. All right. Here we go. You seem pretty out of it. To be honest, I'm also. No, everyone else feels the same mm. too. Agreed. Since we suddenly got put in this weird situation. Hey, are you listening? There we go. Hi, buddy. Hey, hey are you sh sure you're okay? Oh, nope, there you go. Leave me alone. There is no way I can leave someone alone when they look that pale. White sandy beach, crystal blue ocean, the sun rays beating down on me, the soft tropical wind brushing my skin. I definitely don't know what's going on. I was supposed to attend Hope's Peak Academy. Why did this? Why am I here at a place like this? That rabbit thing said we're on a tropical island. You're right. Yeah, you're right. I have no idea what's going on. That's the only thing I can say with absolute certainty. Welcome to Dangan Island! I will explain basic controls to you. With the mouse, you can maneuver a reticle on the screen. If the reticle responds, press the left mouse button. You can then examine that person or object. Also, you can shift your point of view with the WASD keys. Plus, if you press the tab key, you can use a mysterious power to see everything you can examine. The world sure has become super convenient if you want to be able to do all of this from the get-go. Now then, please search this speech thoroughly and progress the story. That was my uh, announcer voice. Was it good? I hope it's good. <laughs> do I have my... I don't have my text. I need... Hold on. Text. Add source. Add that one. 
You need to resize this real quick. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I need to adjust this as well. Hold on a second. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Alright. So now I can go like this. Wait, no. I need the background color, which is black with opacity of like 40, I think it was. No. Sorry, I'm fixing my text stuff real quick. Background opacity needs to be at like 30 or something? Alright, so y'all are going to enjoy that. I have to go swap my laundry, so I will be right back. Alright, I return. Let me let me change this real quick because the colors are all off. Uh, where's my photos? Photos. Camera. What was this one? Thank you! This one was zero zero A A F F F. I think. And this one here, oh shoot, um, that one here was A A F F F F F F F. I think, hold on, 
back here. I gotta change the... Uh, yep. Okay, so this one actually I can adjust the shadow real quick. It's like 50 or something. That works. Yeah, so now that's more in line of what I've got. I also need to change this. I've realized. Uh, hold on a second. I don't want... I want my... Hold on. Let me... Let me click. No, don't... That's not what I wanted. Default. Okay. That looks strange. But that should work. Yes. Oh, welcome back. We both got back at the same time. How does that look? Good? I hope it looks good. Alright, anyways. I'm gonna slide this off so I can be able to hear myself. And bring the game back. Alright. Hi, Hajime. Not Hajime. You're, you're Nagito. Before I should try and talk to that guy, I should... I should... Try to understand the situation I'm in first. Alright, uh... How's the game volume in my voice? I might need to lower it just a tad more. Uh... I just know it's loud on my end. Alright, um... Help. System. Okay, exit the room. Okay, move. Aim, WASD. Talk, lift mouse button, exit, I can also- F1 key. F1? Oh, nope. Why is it F1 key? That shouldn't be the manual. Oh, so V is that. R's the help. No, R's to exit. V is to- he does nothing. What is I P Q A J? I know W A S D. Oh, I didn't mean to click that, but I guess you know that works. Who say heck is commenting on my stuff? Oh. <laughs> Hold on. Sorry, I got reply on the Genshin side of things. Ugh, I'm doing an event. Fedora, I'm doing an event. You should poke my venti. There's gonna be shenanigans. It'll be really cute. <laughs> Alright, uh. Keep my life. <laughs> you, Nagito Kamida! Just, what's going on here? I never went to anything like this at all. So, uh, F1 apparently is the. I don't want that though. Why? Observe is the tab key. Okay, that's also tab key. I don't... I don't want the man... So transcript will bang up the... One? No. That just mutes my volume. How do I change that? Oh, I hate that. What, the, what do you mean you don't know how to interact with my event here right now? Let's just go poke him. He's doing the event thing. I am doing an event. Read over the event pin. That's how this works. It'll be cute. It might be angsty though. So if you want angst, you know, that's the thing. <laughs> it's it, it might be a tad angsty. Just just a tad. Depending on how we go about this. It probably will be. Okay, exit, reset. Observation. I want Open help. Deep T, return. Why did they make the F1 key 
the handbook. I don't understand. Someday. <laughs> if you ever make an account, Sarah, you can willingly interact with my Benji. Or my Albedo. My Albedo is also available for poking. Alright, alright. Let's try it back. Can I talk to you now? Grab my screen for it. Alright, yes. Cool. There's a monitor. Why is there a monitor in a place like this? The screen is blank. What is it being used for? There's seagulls. Coconut trees. I guess this makes sense for there to be palm trees on a tropical island. That's a mighty fine palm tree, but th now it's not the time for me to be impressed by it. Yeah. I've actually said to pick up. You could do child. You could be, you know, your 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 harbinger boy. As soon as you unleash him, skirmish is also a valid option. Alright, um, up the ocean. That's a mad fan palm tree. <laughs> the crystal clear, shining blue sea. It's perfect for a tropical island. Just what's going on here? I never want anything like this at all. I grabbed the camera. I don't think I did. Um, is that a camera? A surveillance camera? Are we being monitored or something? That's not it. I wouldn't say we're being monitored. I think we're just being watched for our safety. <laughs> well, it's a waste of time to think about it. Best not to worry. What's with this guy? How can he be so calm in a situation like this? Maybe he's just a chill guy? Hey. So, how are you feeling? Are you calmed down now? Um, I understand your confusion after everything that's happened. But why don't we start with an introduction? He is. He's very chill. He's a bit messed up, but he's chill, for the most part. He's, um... Sarah, you might like him. Well, I don't know. You might like him or hate him once the trial begins. It's raining outside. I just realized it. It's still- it's raining outside. <laughs> Introduction? I'm Nagito Komaeda. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Nagito Komaeda. <laughs> Alright. Is the volume okay? Is it still good for the audio? Or desktop audio? Oh, is it? Yeah, that's Nagito. That is indeed uh, Mr. Nagito Kamaida. <laughs> I'm assuming you know of him, Soraya. I only see his third in your space in two separate situations. <laughs> so, um, how's the background audio? Good? Yes? Good? Bad? Good? I hope it's good. I'm gonna turn it up just a tad, if that's okay. Maybe just a tad. Alright, uh, along with my introduction. Okay, so I might need to turn it back down again. Just a tad. Alright. I guess I'll also tell you about my talent so you know why I hope Speak Academy chose me. <sighs> well, even if I tell you my case, it's pretty- it's a pretty disappointing talent. A disappointing talent? What do you mean? I'm lucky. <laughs> what are you talking about? That's not it. It's not a joke or anything. That's my actual talent. I'm the ultimate lucky student. At least that's what I'm called anyways. Ultimate lucky student? You're right. Through a country lottery, apparently only one ordinary student is selected at a random at random to extend. So, some context, by the way. This is the thing. Our good friend M Makoto, who's voiced by the same person who's Nagito, and this applies, I think, both in the Japanese and the English versions. Um. Oh, what's it? Um. They both are called the ultimate lucky student, and they both won the lottery. <laughs> Um, well, you want to know a fun thing. His name is actually an anagram of Makoto Naegi Da, which is I am Makoto Naegi. So there you go. That That's your uh, Genshin fun- not Genshin, god. Danganronpa fun fact for the day. <laughs> Hope Speak Academy is the ultimate lucky student. Apparently the similarities between Naegi and Kamaya weren't intended. Huh. Hope Speak Academy has the ultimate lucky student. 
<laughs> that is funny. And the lucky winner just so happened to be me. Chosen by a lottery. Is that really okay? I mean, is luck even a real talent in the first place? How strange. What happened? Your face looks troubled. Oh, I'm not troubled or anything. <laughs> no, it's fine. I have mixed feelings about this too. Someone like me. I never thought an average, talentless high school student like myself would ever enter Hope's Week Academy. At first, I declined. I told them I didn't deserve it. But they told me they really wanted me to attend. Apparently, this so-called luck of mine is a talent that's even, that even the school doesn't fully understand. To research it, the school picks the ultimate lucky student every year through an annual lottery. <laughs> Hope's Peak Academy is amazing if they can actually research something as vague as luck. Well, thanks to that luck, a guy like me was able to attend Hope's Peak Academy. So for that, I'm grateful. This is troubling. But on the other hand, I feel a little out of place here. Ah, sorry. I have a bad habit of viewing most things through a pessimistic lens. There's a reason for that, Nagito. I know why. Um, yeah, I guess that's it for my introduction. Hmm, Nagito Kamaeda, huh? He doesn't seem like the most reliable guy, but he doesn't just strike me as a bad person either. Hey. Alan, it's your turn. Yeah, I'm Hajime Hinata. Then, let me ask you a question. What is your ultimate talent? I know, put your guesses down below. What do you think Kajime Hinata is the ultimate of? I know. I have a feeling Fedora already knows. What do you think, Saraya? Your thoughts? Questions? Answers? <laughs> ultimate <laughs> Fedora. Oh my god. <laughs> no, no guesses? Alright. We all ready? We're gonna advance. Oh, uh, that's a cool protective stars. <laughs> Alright then, that's the guess. Um, I... 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 I opened my mouth, but the words would not form. I felt like my thoughts stalled in my head. As if I opened a book expecting to find words and instead found blank pages. It was that kind of uncomfortable feeling. The memory I was trying to recall had completely vanished from my mind. Huh? Without realizing it, my body began to shudder as waves of discomfort began pounding against me. What happened? Hajime? What happened? Uh, it's nothing. I guess I'm still pretty confused about all this. I'm having trouble remembering some things. Hmm. Nagito Sasaya Hajime. I understand how your memory might be confused after suddenly getting into a situation like this. I'm sure you'll remember soon once you've settled down. So I don't think you need to worry about all that much. You're right. Yep. Then I guess we're done with our introductions for now. Even though I don't know what's going on, I hope we can get along. Whee! Hey, did something just beep? What a weird sound. I guess I struck, stuck my hand into my pocket. That's right. A strange mechanical sound just def now definitely came from the inside of my pocket. What the hell is this? It's like a PDA or a smartphone. God, that dates it. PDA, jeez. Does anyone use PDAs anymore? Is that- I know they probably still exist, but Jesus. Hmm. Uh, Alright then. <laughs> Why is something like that inside my pocket? Are you okay? The zombie was passing them out earlier, remember? <laughs> oh right, you seemed pretty out of it when that was going on. Now that you mention it, I can't remember, but... What is this? <laughs> it's me, hey fuck! What the... Where'd you come from? I'm sorry! Oh, did I startle you? I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> I know how to apologize like a good girl. Um... Anyways, don't you think it's cool? 
Dave handbook is absolutely vital for the school trip, so make sure you don't lose it! This device is that... It's not a this device is that important? I shall explain. I should ask everyone to use the Eve handbooks to gather all the hope fragments. The hope fragments? That's right. Um, on the island, you'll contain hope fragments as you get along with your classmates. As your relationship with everyone improves, you'll be able to gather more and more hope fragments. Gather hope fragments so that the flower of hope achieves this full bloom. Truly, that is the main purpose of this school trip. Love, love. <laughs> hey! And she's gone. A stuffed animal that moves, talks, and also appears whenever and whenever she wants. Regardless of who's actually controlling it, it still doesn't make any sense. And what was all that about hope fragments? And what's her deal? It's like we're in a game or something. But um. <laughs> Thank you, Danganronpa, for breaking the fourth wall. This is your hydration reminder, by the way. If you haven't hydrated, go get some water or something. <clears throat> I have to hydrate a lot because I'm talking a ton. So, you know. <clears throat> hydrate. It's important. I always bring two glasses of water to my streams. That might seem excessive, but that limits my amount of time away from the stream. And also, it just keeps me hydrated. So. Hydration is important to all y'alls. We're like an hour and ten minutes into the stream, so. <clears throat> if this feels like a game, that's rather comforting. That means we aren't going to be in danger right away. You're probably right, but... More importantly, you don't know anything about the other students yet, right? Yep. Then I think it's best if you at least introduce yourself to them. That's also true, but where did everyone go? Perhaps. Maybe they're exploring the island as well? Exploring the island? Hey. Hmm. As long as we're expecting to live on this island, we should learn as much as we can about it. A lot of words. Look at me stumbling on my own words. Woo! For example, what's this island's name? Is there a way to escape? What about food and living arrangements? So, why don't we finish introducing ourselves to the others and explore the island at the same time? I pretty much went around and introduced myself to everyone already, but I'll tag along with you. So now he's deciding to come with me. Well, I guess that's helpful for me. I know I'd worried if I was left on my own. All right. Shall we get going then? But is this really okay? To feel so relaxed in a strange situation. Perhaps it's the tropical climate? Or is that what's her name? Usami's fault? What happened? What is it, Ajime? Let's get going. Right, got it. At any rate, if this is a nightmare, I'd have no idea if it, if it's even started yet. Sheesh, what kind of nightmare is this? You are now able to use the handbook. You can use it to check various information throughout the game. You can open the handbook with the F1 key. It's super easy! This, it includes the guidelines of the school trip and report card, which documents everyone's information. There are various features inside your handbook. You can also save and load your game inside the handbook. Please check out the systems page as well. But wait, there's more! You can also view the transcript with the F2 key. That's all there is about the handbook. I strongly recommend you play around with it yourself. Now then, please look, go forth and look for everyone else. All oh, right, you can exit the beach with the R key. Okay, so the F1 key doesn't do much. I'm afraid of poking the other keys. Nope, nope, get... So it said the F1 key. Well, that's just messing with my... Can I just not access my... What? Oh! Oh! It's just one! Um, there isn't. You just constantly see it from his perspective. Though so then, when we, um... Oh, uh, when we move... Um, around the islands. 
at least. So it's just the one key. Okay. You got him. I can't view the map yet. Presents! Whee! We have a ton of presents. That we can't. Um, there is, and we'll see him also in the class trials. Yeah, remember when I said there's murder? Yeah, there's murder. It's not yet, but it, there will be murder. We may not get to the murder yet. Um, your park card. Haji, there we go. There's Hajime. <laughs> it's January 1st, born on the... Ah, born on the 1st. How about that? Yes. And then, what? Oh, Q, Q, Q and E. Alright, so we got Nagito Komaida. He's 5'9, he's a tall boy. Very tall boy. He's an inch, he's an inch taller than Hajime. <clears throat> um, he was born on April 20th. He likes pretty things and he hates noisy places. Huh. Now we know nothing about the other students here. Sonia, I love you. But we'll know more about them. And he is the ultimate lucky student. Cool. Oh, have we... Can I look at... Misami. Can you... No? No? Oh, I guess I can't do it. Alright, fine. Regulations, pet. There's an... Oh, I forgot there's an e-pet! I forgot there was an e pet! <laughs> it's a Tomogachi. Alright, system. Transcript, option. Okay. Cool. Alright, perfect. <clears throat> cool. Alright, that's perfect. <clears throat> All right, let's leave. Yep. Hey. Ah, about exploring the island. It appears a map of this island has been installed into this heap book. If you use it, you should be able to find everyone easily. Actually, to be honest, before I arrived at the school, I did some research about everyone on the internet. Are you sure he wasn't intended to be, you know, basically a copy of Nagito? Adora, because I'm pre or not Nagito, Makoto, because the fact that he did everything. He's basically Makoto, but um. <laughs> I guess there is. Alright, let's see here. Um. Uh, look up your classmates on the internet. I don't know. I mean, if you're famous, you know, talent people, that would make sense. I haven't learned every learned everything about everyone, but I'm pretty sure I can give you some helpful info. Wait, you can research stuff like that on the internet? See, Hajime has the same thoughts you do, Soraya. Huh? Uh, you don't know? This school is so popular, there are message boards online dedicated to talking about its students. Then, was I also? Mm -hmm. I don't recall seeing your name there. I probably overlooked it. How unexpected. Well, it's not your fault if you can't really remember. I'm sure my name was mentioned on there. It's not a mistake I was accepted into Hope Speak Academy. Yep. Anyways, I'll up too. So why don't we begin with making your introductions? Okay, you're right. So first I need to introduce myself to everyone else on this island. Then... Oh, I should apologize. There's something I forgot to tell you. If you look at the map in your e handbook, you will be able to see where everyone is. You can also instantly travel to any locations. Way to go! Also, when you travel to a point with an exclamation part, the story will... Uh, the exclamation mark, the story will progress. It's super convenient. Now then, let's go! I hope my, uh... I hope my, uh, my voice is <laughs> very much... Travel on the island can be done through this screen. You can move with the WASD keys. You can run by holding the shift key while you move. If you press the Q and E keys, you can also instantly move to the next area. When the reticle responds, you can go inside places by pressing the left mouse button. You've probably realized it by now, but you happen to have a, your very own pet inside your e-handbook. Your pet grows based on the number of steps you've taken, so try to walking to places instead of using map jump. 
When you finish raising your pet, there may be a small reward. Fun. Oh, oh, hot, uh, okay, so there we go. <laughs> Hajime, what is your walk? You look so awkward. <laughs> look at this run, look at this run. He looks so awkward. Just, just look at that. Alright, um, let's head to... I don't want to head there yet. Let's head to the hotel. Alright. Wow, this is a pretty nice hotel. Perhaps? The Hotel Mirai, huh? It looks like it's named for the Japanese word for future. When we were told to live on this island, I was worried we'd have to pitch a tent or something. I'm glad. If we can live in a grand hotel like this, I don't think we'll have to worry about being comfortable. <laughs> Comfort isn't an option here. We don't even know why we're being forced to live on this island. How can you just accept this? You're way too excited about living here. Hey. Uh, I think I'm just gonna use my normal voice. I was trying to do a voice for Hajime, but I'm just gonna use my normal one at this point. Hmm. <clears throat> Well, it seems pretty obvious that this area would make it for a good base, so why don't we look around for a bit? Why is this guy so calm? It's like he doesn't think this situation is a big deal at all. Has he been through a lot of trauma or something? <laughs> He's like Joshua! <laughs> oh god, alright. Hi, Nagito. <laughs> a map will be displayed if you press the tab key. I said the tab key. Don't make me repeat myself. Ooh, okay. Okay, I... Okay. I'm glad. If we can live in a grand hotel like this, I don't think we'll have to worry about being comfortable. Yeah, I go. Alright, cool. So, I think we're gonna have to go into the hotel, perhaps? Nice sprint. Oh, yes. Okay. Oh, hi, Nakumaru. <gasps> That's right. You haven't told me your name. Oh. My name. I am the ultimate team manager, Nakumaru Nidai. My poor voice is going to hate me for this. At least I've had a lot of practice up front. Oh, <laughs> uh, what is Fox sending? Oh. Oh, the update for Union Cross is. Uh, hold on a second. I forgot Union Cross's story ends on the 31st. Hot dang. Um, hello. I'm Hajime Hinata. Your voice is too soft. Hold it right there. Your voice is too soft. Let your voice rise from the bottom of your stomach. Um, I'm Hajime Hinata. Nakamura, I can't be any louder. I'm going to wake up. <laughs> no, you can No, you can't. You gotta be louder than that. Do it again. I can't be louder. I'm in a house of people. That is literally impossible. My name is Hajime Hinata. Please submit your requests. I am Nekomaru Nida. Don't forget it, even if you go to hell. <laughs> oh my god. I am the ultimate team manager, Nekomaru Nida. You don't need to repeat your name so much, I won't forget it. <laughs> <laughs> I agree to your terms. He sure is boisterous, but it's not just his voice. His whole body seems loud. Yep. Nekumaru Nidai is, is known as the ultimate team manager. The ultimate team manager? So he's not on a team, he just manages one? Nope. He's not just a team manager. After all, he is an ultimate. He traveled to numerous towns and played an active role in various sports clubs in managing their teams. For an instance, he led some high school rep team full delinquents to victory in the natural playoff. Isn't that the plot of a movie or something? Moneyball? I think it was Moneyball. Yes, I think it was because I am removed. It wasn't about delinquents, but it was about a bunch of players that nobody wanted. 
and he managed to lead, and the guy managed to lead him. Is it? I just remember Moneyball because we had to watch it for a math class. We watched like three movies in that math class. That math class wasn't really even a math class, but it counted, so I'm gonna take it. He also rescued a baseball club on the very verge of being shut down and led them to national victory as well. Rumor has it he's even training a fast, famous Japanese pitcher who plays in the American League. If that's all true, he totally deserves to be called the ultimate team manager. <laughs> but with a build like his, he'd be better off playing on the team instead of managing. Hi, Nekumaru. So, what's your introduction? So, he likes a freshly washed towel. He's 6'4. God dang, dude. Uh, he hates lazy people. Alright then. Thank you, Nekumaru. Oh, wow. Oh. What does this look like? Huh. <laughs> Alright, um, let's see. Oh god, that's Susie. Oh, hey! Hey! Hey, aren't you the guy who was squatting on the beach earlier and burying your face in your arm? Uh, yeah? You are a boy, hey, right? you gotta keep it together, you know. At the times like this, it's a boy's job to keep the girls safe. You're right. Yeah, yeah. Did you want me to introduce myself? I haven't done it yet, right? Let's see. I'm Mahiro Koizumi. I'll be counting on you from now on. <laughs> Mahiro! Mahiro! I like her. I like her a lot. She's actually pretty chill. She's the ultimate photographer. I like her a lot. She's very chill, despite the comment. Actually, Mahiro is known as the ultimate photographer. She's a promising future as a photojournalist. I'm not an expert on photography, but I hear she's a young photographer who has won numerous awards. On that note, she's known for her skill at taking pictures of people. The ultimate photographer, huh? Oh, there is a camera hanging from her neck. I kind of assumed that already. Honestly, I'm a little rev relieved. You guys seem decent enough. Mm hmm, decent. <laughs> well, there's lots of weirdos out there. Weirdos here. I can't tell if they're really ultimates or like just insane. <laughs> I'm eager to get along with everyone so we can get off this island, but I was worried things wouldn't go well. Get off this island? What do you mean? Huh? Oh, thank you. Jesus. My CPU is okay, we've only dropped a couple frames, so we're good. Huh? You don't know? That's what the stuffed animal was- it was Sophie was saying. After you finish collecting all the hope fragments that you earned by getting along with everyone- Come on! This joke of a school trip will be over, and we can finally leave this island together. That's all we have to do and we can go home? Is that true? Did you really mean that? You guys believe it? Jeez. Hey, you should be paying close attention. This is, like, really important. Hey. Well, Hajime, now you know this, you must feel a little relieved, right? As long as we live here peacefully, we'll be able to leave the silent soon enough. So there's no reason for you to act so panicky. Even so... What's the reason? Why do we have to do something like this? I mean, to go through all the effort of bringing us here so we can live together and get along? It doesn't make any sense. What? I may not know why we're here, but if that's all we have to do to go home, then all that's all there is to it. I'm glad. Overall, I'm glad. It means it's not really that big of a deal. Oops. That's what I want, didn't want to do. Boop. Not a big deal? Really? We're told we're on a school trip without any warning. Then we're taken to a place like this. And then we're told to forget about Hope Speak Economy? Is he sure this isn't a big deal? Hey! Hey! Eh? You... Don't eh me? What about your introduction? I've been waiting like forever, you know? Ah, sorry. I'm Hajime Hinata. Um, it's nice to meet you too. Hmm. I see. Hajime Hinata, huh? Too bad. Sorry to disappoint you, but I've already made a mental note to remember you as unreliable, Hajime. You better do your best. It's gonna be tough for you to change my mind. You better man up and try even harder to do your best. <laughs> I see her whipped already, Hajime. Got it? I'm talking to both of you. Do better, man up, and do better. Got it? I swear she's good. I like her a lot. 
Excuse me. Uh, no, no, no. This building, old building, is in the middle of a renovation project, so you cannot go inside. It's dangerous, as you know. Showing up out of nowhere is even more dangerous. <laughs> Alright. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. I should probably go in. Can I go inside? We're gonna go. Oh, God. There we go. Going inside. You did I get added? Why did I get added? Oh! Fedora. <laughs> Fedora, you're welcome. You're welcome to participate in the event. It's just I. Yeah. Ah. Uh, well. Last time you saw him, he was like a little spirit. Okay. Oh my God. All right then. <laughs> Fedora, your prompts. Jeez. No, I just read it. I'm like trying to figure out how I'm gonna go. So, what's okay? So Carmen's been taught in that. Okay. So Carmen survives. That that's obvious. But this is just like a couple years later. Okay. I'm like trying to get the the the, the bearings for this. Oh my god, we're gonna have to DM later and like double check this out. If you want to participate in the event, feel free. Like, if you want to make it part of your thing too, I I have no arguments. I'm just doing. This. I did. This. Yeah, it was. Yeah, that works. I think. Um, I think I said it like 15 to 20 years after the events of such. You know, to give Monster a bit of time to rebuild. Benji was along, around for that time, right? Right, Sora, uh, we went over Kenshin's lore earlier today. We should know that. <laughs> it's good. Uh, we can't go inside. Fine then. How do I? I would like to zoom out my camera. That'd be nice. Well, uh, oh, jeez. The, 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 the thingy pet. Neopet. Oh. Top? I don't have a, I don't have a present. I don't have a bet. Don't explain. Sorry, I don't have. Okay, space? Chippy! Chippy me! Oh, that's so cute! Oh, he's so cute! Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're adorable! Stop being so cute! I love it. It's the baby you saw me. Okay, where am I going? I can't get over there. So can I like a hotel restaurant? Hajime. Ah, fine. You can't find anyone, but you, if you want to be so insistent, oh, I leveled up. You level up by walking around. I've realized that now. All right, Nagito, we're gonna go. What's this? Oh, jeez. Alright, uh, where's mine? That's not mine, that's Fuyuhiko's. That's Byakuya's. That's Nekumara's, that's Nagito's. Where's mine? That's Teratiru's. That's gone. Where's mine? That's Chiaki. Is mine. Excuse me? Cause that isn't mine. Oh, this is mine. Th this is mine. Oh, how'd you make? This is yours. Alright, um. I don't see anybody. I think we'll exit here. How'd you make? What do you mean? I don't know what else is around here. Am I supposed to click click on the doors or something? Shocky? 
Ah. What do you mean? Am I supposed to click? I see literally nobody else. I'm gonna call crimes. Ah! Hey, Hiko. You scared me. Hi, buddy. Ah, who the hell are you? Don't talk all friendly and stuff to me, idiot. <laughs> he was the one I'm gonna have to do the most censoring with because he swears a lot. So, um, bear with me. This guy is already in a crappy mood. You... What are you looking at? You got something you want to say? No, no. no. Relax, we go. We we're only here to introduce ourselves. Huh? Huh? Introduce yourselves. Hey. See, you haven't been properly introduced to each other, right? Hmm. Name's Fuyuhiko Kuzuryu. Just so we're clear, I don't plan to act friendly and shit with you guys. So, Soraya, fun fact, this guy is voiced by, uh, the same person who does, uh, Evan in Kingdom Hearts. Surprised? <laughs> uh. Don't worry, if you hit him, he gets better. I think. Even though he's got a baby face, he's also incredibly rude. Fuyuhiko um, is a high school student and heir to the Kuzuryu clan. Eh? The Kuzuryu clan? Don't tell me he's... Yep. I'm sure you at least heard of them before, right? The Kuzuryu clan is the largest criminal syndicate in the nation, with a membership surpassing 30,000. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure they should- I think it's what, Derek Stephen Prince that does Evan's voice and then does this guy here. I think that's the same person. I'm like 90% sure. So, um... <laughs> Anyways. Evan also runs a, you know, large criminal syndicate, I guess. <laughs> How admirable. Which means he's the ultimate Yakuza. The heir to a Yakuza clan, and it's a thief. He's Kazurio clan, no less. Actually... By the way, mentioning his baby face around him is expressly forbidden, so you better be careful. Get around that figures before he's done with you. But that was so close. I nearly lost all my fingers. I need my fingers to type and, and play things. Now, I can tell you're, you're like my savior or something. You're not an angel, but you're, 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 you get a pass this time. <laughs> you're just exaggerating it. Guess not. Hey, bastard! If we're done here, how about you idiots make like a tree and leave? <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh... <laughs> you know, it could be worse. We could be playing Danganronpa 3, and we'd have to deal with it new. Oh no, no. Uh... Can I leave? I wanna leave. Yeah. Um. Can we go in now? Yes, I'm in. Um, Naki says, like, Josh, but he's just a bit more off his rocker. I'm glad. Yeah, even this is inside of this place looks grand, too. If it was a really enormous school trip, I'd be smiling right now. Oh, wait, whoops. That's Hajime. I thought that was Naki, too. But why are they the only ones in this hotel? Now, now. It's an uninhabitable island. It can't be helped. An uninhabited island. This hotel looks pretty well kept, and it seems electricity won't be an issue. What in the world's going on with this island? Hey, Peku, Peku Yama. State your business. Well, I just want to introduce myself. Is that all right with you? <laughs> yeah, he's um. Wait until the first trial. I think the first trial is when you see how unhinged he is. An introduction. Understood. Understood. I don't mind. 
I'm Hajime Hinata. Nice to meet you. My name is Peko Pekoyama. It is nice to meet you too. She's the ultimate swordswoman. <laughs> Actually, this dignified woman looking woman is known as the ultimate swordswoman. It's hard to believe someone with a cute name like Peko Peko Yama could be so skilled with a blade. I heard she's a kendo master and that most adult men don't even stand a chance against her. Well, there is definitely something with her. Her eyes are really intense. It appears. If what that rabbit said is true, we are expected to live on this island. Together. Yeah, you're right. It is necessary for men and women who live together to respect each other. Don't try anything inappropriate. <laughs> I would prefer not to kill anyone. Kill? Isn't that sword on your back made of bamboo? Yes. Though it may be impossible to kill someone with this, a missed aimed blow can be fatal. Well, well, an aimed blow can be fatal too. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, thank you, Pekko. <gasps> Chucky! There's some girl playing an arcade game and she looks completely absorbed by it. Hajime. Hajime, you probably haven't introduced yourself. Yeah, you haven't properly introduced yourself to her either, right? Yeah, you're right. She seemed really focused on her game, but I guess I should try and talk to her. Um, excuse me, I'd like to introduce myself. Hey! Hey, Chiaki! <gasps> huh? Sorry, I must have been a little too focused on my game. A little? Are you sure about that? Um, let's see. Oh, right. Introductions. Got it. I'm Chiaki Nanami, the ultimate gamer. Video games are my hobby, and I'm a fan of all genres. Ow. I, I poked the thing. I'm sorry. Nice to meet you. I'm Hajime Hinata. Nice to meet you, too. Yep. Yeah, totally. It seems like this conversation is going rather slow. <laughs> well, she is gaming right now. Well? It's more like... I'm the kind of person who has to gather my thoughts before I can start talking. Like, I can't talk that well unless I've already prepared everything I want to say in my head. Especially when I'm meeting new people. Well, if I get used to them, I can usually talk a little faster. She's still focused on her game and she hasn't looked at me at all. Maybe the ultimate gamer, but how can she play video games at a time like this? <laughs> sleepy. I'm sleepy. <laughs> oh my god, I I, <laughs> I love you, Tiaki. I guess this is a receptionist desk, but there's nobody here. A machine. This place even has an arcade machine. <laughs> Isn't it great? This sure is a grand hotel. It's like we're in an inn at a hot spring district or something. Whee! So, I'm gonna take a moment out and to check our report card. Who do we got? Um. So we got Mr. Kuzurio, Fuyuhiko. He's tiny! He's tiny, he's baby. He likes fried dough cookies and he hates milk. Understandable. Um, we got Chiaki. Oh wait, when's your birthday? August 16th. <laughs> oh gosh. Uh, she likes games, even crappy games, so shovelware. And she hates alarm clocks. Hmm. She was born on March 14th. Who else do we have? Oh yeah, Mahiro Koizumi. She likes traveling alone and she hates bad manners. We got Peko, Peko who likes black and he, she doesn't like candy. And then I don't think... Do we talk? Do we check out? Yeah, we already checked out Nekumara's. Ugh, oh, hiccups. Alright. Can I climb the stairs? Nope, I didn't want to do that. Can I climb the stairs? Let me up.
So this is the hotel restaurant. Amazing! It's enormous. We could easily hold a banquet in here. It kind of has a tropical, open country feeling. Open? Even though we're stuck on this island? Hmm. Are we really stuck here? What else could it be? Sorry. Oh well. Let's finish introducing ourselves. Look, there are two people talking over there. <laughs> okay. So, a fair warning. I hate this character. This guy right here on screen. And, to put it lightly, he is a, um... A little lusty person. Very sexually driven, to say at least. Hey, Ariel, hi. <laughs> I hate her too. It's... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's just <laughs> <Soraya. laughs> Yeah, so he's a very um inappropriate person, so uh just a fair warning, I'm probably gonna skip his lines if I can. That's sad. I'm having a hard time because it's full of poison. It really sucks. Speaking of which be great. <laughs> Poison. Poison. I see. Hey, do you guys have a moment? Mama? Whoa. Denied. Denied? Good day. Hello. It is nice to meet you. Uh, hello. My name's Hajime Hinata. Nice to meet you, too. Hello there. Why, hello there. You must be the new guy. My name is Teru Teru Hanamura. On the streets, I'm known as the ultimate cook. So, Soraya, this guy <laughs> shares the same voice as a razor. <laughs> I, I wish I was kidding. It's I'm not. That that's Todd Habercorn. Hello, Todd Habercorn. <laughs> I'm sorry to break it to you like this. <sighs> but could you guys call me the ultimate chef instead? It has more of a big city flavor to it, you know? <laughs> I don't like Terra Terra. Nobody likes Terra Terra. Everyone hates Terra Terra. Mmm, <laughs> I hope we gain along well. I am sorry! Oh, that reminds me. I have not properly introduced myself either. I am terribly sorry to keep you waiting. My name is Sonia Nevermind. I love you, Sonia! <laughs> How do you even like Tara too? I mean, I respect your decision, but jeez, how do you like him? It's kind of gross. Ugh. <laughs> I am from a foreign exchange. I am a foreign exchange student from a small European kingdom called Novoselic. I may cause trouble here and there, but I hope we can get along well. Same here. I hope we get along well, too. White porcelain skin, sparkling blue eyes, and her hair glitters like a field of wheat. It's like she has this mysterious charm that I want to gaze at forever. <laughs> Are you enchanted? Well, that probably can't be helped. She's known as the ultimate princess, which means she's actually royalty. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I applaud those who actually, like, dress up as Terra Terra. Like, go, good for you. I bought any cosplayers at this point. Um, the ultimate princess? Normally I'd be surprised to hear that, but it's not just her beauty. She's so graceful. I'm completely at ease even though she's a real princess. Um, um this may be rude of me to say, but truthfully, I feel very happy. Huh? What are you happy about? I... In my home country, I did not have a single friend my age whose standing in society matched my own. So to be able to do something like this with everyone is a new experience for me. I shall praise you. I say they'll extol your virtues. Extol my virtues? The thanks? What the? I feel so I suddenly feel the urge to drop on one knee and bow. <laughs> hey, Yathay, am I being left out the menu or something? No, that's not it. <laughs> oh, Terra Terra, it's so lucky to check out the restaurant first. As the ultimate chef, do you like it? <laughs> mm -hmm. I wouldn't be lying if I said I wasn't interested. And since I do not want to be a liar, then truthfully... Yeah, I like it. Well, guess that's about it. 
You're one and only yet? If you're talking about Soda, no we haven't. We haven't- we haven't met him yet. Though I do like Baby City Flavor. Oh, Gundam. No, we haven't met Gundam yet. I don't think I've had his appearance on screen yet. Which is strange. Though I do like Big City Flavor in my hometown, the country atmosphere like this is also splendid. Mm -hmm. Hey, are you? I understand. Refined, cultured, guilty as charged. No, not that. You just don't seem very worried, huh? Worried? What's there to worry about? Actually, I'm really happy. Happy? Why is that? Mm -hmm. I can get serious real quick. Nope! What? Bonjour. Nope! Mm, you're gross. You're gross. No thanks. Mm. Oh my god. Sorry, I'm skipping about the dialogue. This is. I'm skipping about the dialogue. It makes me uncomfortable. Is that why you're talking about Poison Ivy? Uh, pardon me. What are you talking about? <laughs> we'll discuss it later. <laughs> I better not see you try to that again. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'm a fan of how about stuff. I just can't help but look forward to living on this island. <laughs> when it comes to cooking and love, fashion is the most important ingredient. <laughs> This guy seems dangerous, but for a completely different reason. Oh dear lord. I'm okay with like, usually in a subject of stuff, but when I do it on stream, I'm just like, no thank you. That's why I mentioned I would not be like, much reading out some of his more uh, risky lines. <laughs> <sighs> okay, so one. Report card. Yes, I'm not. Yes, that that. Yeah, we haven't met Gundam yet. We did meet Chucky. So, um, Teruto Hanamura. He likes his mama, but he hates junk food, and he's very short. Where is Sonia? She likes the occult, and she likes Japan, and she doesn't like sour gloves. Oh, go get dinner. A party of food. Yes, we've already met Chiaki. <laughs> He's very adorable. Ah, where's my pet? Hi, buddy. You're very cute. You're adorable. <laughs> Alright, um, where am I going? Have you guys I already talked to them? I want to leave the room. Yes, I would like to go outside. So I think I've met everyone here. Oh god. Mouse right. So I think I've met everyone here. Jesus. So I think I can leave this part. Honestly, so <laughs> I'm hold on. Um Game Manager. I'm gonna edit something. Um, I want to see if I could change this to this. All right. Well, that's something else. All right. I don't have as much. As I normally have, oh, I can. Okay, here we go. Anyways, look, look at it, look at it. Oh my God! I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, look, 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 let me go. I'm walking so I can grow my neo plant. I forgot there's a whole farm here. Is there anyone here? Oh wait, no, this is where Gundam is, isn't it? Oh, thanks. This looks like a ranch. The 
we're back to zooming. Um, so, Saraya, uh, Sonia likes uh, Japan, but she also likes the occult. The, that's your fact, fact for today. Um, though there aren't many animals around. Oh. Right? Oh, you found out. You again? Seriously, where do you keep appearing from? I, I can show up anywhere, anytime. The system allows me to appear anywhere on this island. Ta -da! It's all thanks to the handy handy magic stick. Magic stick, huh? Is she talking about that toy she's holding? Hmm. Hmm. Still, I am quite troubled. A ranch without any moo cows is like a soccer team without any balls. You. You might want to rephrase that. I just got it. I'm sorry. Thank you, Nike Tom, for pointing out. Alrighty. <laughs> Alrighty. Sleep me. Leave it to me. My handy dandy magic stick. Bibbidi bobbidi, bibbidi bobbidi, bibbidi bobbidi, bobbidi bobbidi. <laughs> Boo! Turn into a moo cow. Whee! A huge success! What, what was that all now? Chicken changed into a cow. That's not it. Ah, that's probably some sort of trick or illusion. I bet it was a setup before he got here. She probably knew how to make us happy, but I guess it had the opposite effect on you, Ajime. A trick and illusion? Well, if you think about it rationally, it makes sense. A chicken can't just change into a cow. cow. Messing with living things like that is just not cool, you know? It really did, yes. Anyways. Oh god. I am I need to move. Oh. Okay, so I can't move forward. Alrighty. Squish! Squish! <laughs> What's this kid doing? She's sitting down and she keeps pressing her finger onto the floor with all her strength. Um, are you okay? I haven't introduced myself, right? My name is Hajime Hinata. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm Hiyoko Sayanji. Squish, squish. She hasn't stopped pressing her finger into the floor. Seriously, what is she doing? I know your parents and voice are so young. I can't believe she's actually a high school student. Actually, Yoko's challenge has made her known as the ultimate traditional dancer. As a rookie, the Japanese dancing industry expects a lot from her. She's already perform performed overseas many times. It seems her performances are popular among the young audiences, which is rare in the Japanese dancing industry. Then again, her fans are mostly men. <laughs> It's probably because she looks so young. Her fans have probably have the same niche or something. Squish, squish. Hey, what are you exactly doing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm squishing. Squishing what? Mr. Ant, duh. Mr. Ant, of course. I'm squishing lots of Mr. Ants. Come again? <laughs> <laughs> if you squish their tummy is just right, it makes this awesome sound. Thank you. Want to do it together? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> this kid, her attitude doesn't match her appearance at all. <laughs> That's Yoko for you. Alright. Time for another one. Yo. Hey, who are you dudes? It's finally nice to meet you. I'm Hajime Hinata. Gotcha. And who's this other dude? What? Ah, uh, haven't we already met? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I pretty much suck at remembering names. I met so many interesting characters today. I'm Haji... No, I'm Dagi Tokamaida. If you can, please don't forget my name again. Yo, the name's Akane Owari. Nice to meet ya. Oh, it's not good. <laughs> yes. The ultimate gymnast. Hina was better. Well, Akane is known as the ultimate gymnast and an all-around super athlete. Rumor has it she has a wild troublemaker, for athletic ability is off the charts. However, her basics and fundamentals are all over the place, so her gymnastics routines are mostly improvised. If she's in her groove, she performs splendidly, but if she's not, she loses all interest and switches it up. Oh, self-centered. 
No matter how you cut it, she definitely sounds like a troublemaker. Even though- so, she's called the ultimate gymnast for a reason, so her performances must be amazing to see. I can't visualize her as a normal high school student. I mean, she's got the physique of an Olympic athlete. What? Huh? Don't tell me you. No oh, I get it. Mm. You're being really loud. You know you're doing that on purpose. No, I don't have a thing for that. Jesus. Come on, you just like breaking the force for us. Even if we're being monitored for our own safety, we're still being watched all the same. It's not really a good feeling. Lord. Mother. This is like that blank screen. It doesn't look like a normal television. Seriously, what the heck is that? Burb! A tropical bird. That's what I should call it, right? I have no idea what's going on anymore. I want to poke the cow. Based on appearance, it looks like a regular run-of-the-mill cow. What kind of trick is changing a chicken into a cow anyways? Oh, we got the cow. We got the burb. You got Nagito. I think we're good. Yes. Chicken, 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 <laughs> Alright. So, we've been to the ranch. I'm gonna take some steps. So, that's the central island, which I don't think we're supposed to go right now. There's the beach. I don't want to go to the beach. I think I was there originally. Um, there is an airport. I'm gonna check out the airport. I can't remember if anybody's here. New airport. Oh, there we go. This is an airport, right? So those things over there must be airplanes? Couldn't we use those planes to escape this island? Uh, nah, it's impossible. If they were damaged, I could fix them up. But it looks like these planes are just for show. Just for show? Man. The engines have been completely removed. Nothing I can do about that. Completely removed? Whoever brought us home to this island must have also done that, right? <laughs> Her tongue. I'm surprised you're concerned about his tongue and not his teeth. The same person is controlling that stuffed animal of Sami. But who's doing this? Why did they bring us to this island in the first place? And how did they do it? The more I think about it, the less it makes sense. That's right! Oh yeah, that reminds me. You and me haven't been in a jizz, right? Name's Kazuichi Soda. I'm the ultimate mechanic. Nice to meet ya. <laughs> and this is except the short tail. Fair enough. <laughs> you haven't seen Genocide Jack. That tongue is a time. Just weird. Genocide Jack's weird. Or Genocide Jill, I'm not sure. I need to buy a Rumble one. That's what I should have started with. But yeah. Ooh. Comments? Somebody's contacting me about an event. The event I'm doing right now, at least. What does that say? OMG, yeah. Yeah, her tongue. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you're right. Alright, I might hope this I can get through all the intro introductions quickly. As expected from someone called the Ultimate Mechanic, Kazuichi is a savant when it comes to fixing machines. If he says it's impossible to fix this plane, it's truly beyond repair. Hey. Even so, to actually remove the engine? Whoever's keeping us here must plan this to a day. You think so too, huh? Doesn't mean that's... doesn't seem pretty strange to you. That was close. Yeah, it's pretty strange. I think it's an acceptable level of strange, you know? It's an acceptable level of strange. Uh-huh. I mean... Well, think about it. It's not like we're being forced to do something dangerous or anything. Ah. Uh. That was mentioned in the safety precautions for the school trip. 
Remember the school trip guidelines written in the EU handbook? I haven't even checked those out yet. Extreme violence is prohibited on this island. Please live peaceful and relaxing lives with your fellow students. Be considerate of each other and work together to ho obtain hope fragments. Littering is not allowed. Let's coexist with this island's beautiful, bountiful nature in mutual prosperity. Len the lead teacher cannot directly interfere with the students. An exception to this rule made is if any students violate a rule. Thank you. For now. It looks like we're being kept safe, so why not? Why wouldn't this be like any other school trip? Mm. There's nothing dangerous on this island. Spend these peaceful, relaxing days nourishing hope. Just as Usami said earlier. <laughs> Are you saying you believe that thing she told us? She's forced us to come here, you know. But don't be such a pessimist. You know, you should look at this situation with a bit more hope, you know? Hope, 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 hope. Optimism is essential for people to live satisfied lives. That's right! Yeah, I guess that's okay if we just plan our vacation and see how this whole thing plans out, right? <laughs> <laughs> if you stay in close, stare closely at the strange looking bunny girl, she might start looking pretty cute. I'm actually jealous of how carefree he's being right now. Alright, Ariel, you're about to meet your beloved. Are you ready? Sir, are you ready for one of the most extra people in this game? <laughs> <laughs> You're about to be one of the most extra people in this game. Soraya, I hope you are ready. Stop right there. If you value your life, do not come any closer. Let me know what I'm doing with my voice. <laughs> huh? Hmm. I said stand back. Oh, very well. I shall accept that courage of yours. What is this guy talking about? <laughs> Would you like to know my name? Others may see it as courage, see your courage as recklessness. I have welcome it. Listen well. In honor of your courage, I shall reveal to you my name. May you never forget it as long as you live. You may call me. Gundam Tanaka. Remember it well, for it is the name that will one day rule this world. <laughs> Place your guess in down in the comments below what you think his ultimate talent is. Ariel already knows. Soraya, what is your guess? <laughs> Makes the best cut in the world. <laughs> oh, unfortunately, Soraya, you were wrong. He is the ultimate breeder. Which which is like animals. He takes care of animals. Rule this world? He's kidding, right? If he's actually serious, that's pretty out there. Let me ask. Now then, it's my turn to ask questions. Whose master are you? Huh? you? Which tribe did you make your pact with? Answer me. Uh, what do you mean by pact? Answer me now. <laughs> <laughs> Though I shall cast you into a watery grey once you do. Then it's best if I don't answer. <laughs> Perhaps? I think he's asking if you used to have a pet. Hey! No, the only animal I've, I've, I've taken care of was a hermit crab we passed around in elementary school. Impossible! So a mere insect. Face your powerlessness! Your magic essence caps at a lonely five. Trash! Tr tr trash? Really? <laughs> Is it wrong to call trash 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 like you should not dare to speak one as gr to one as grand as me? My name is Gundam Tanaka. Yes, he, he was. It was very fun. It was great. Who do you think I am? I am the great and powerful Gundam Tanaka, supreme overlord of ice. Look at his hamsters. Look at his hamsters. 
He's so cute. Just, just look at him. <laughs> I love him. He's very cute. Very adorable. The Dark Devas. Yes, the Dark Devas. I apologize. His Dark Devas of Destruction. <laughs> Squishy Deva. <laughs> Hold on a minute, something strange just came out of your scarf. This is the Tanaka Empire! It's an orchestra. <laughs> Saving evil by using my stuff as a bed. Truly, this is the secret art of the Tanaka Empire. <laughs> it's like something you see on a nature show. I guess he totally fits the bill of Ultimate Breeder. One of my four dark devas of destruction, Mirage Golden Heart Jumpy, has this to say. We're not going to get. To, we're not used to going easy on our enemies, so don't make us angry. You wouldn't like us when we're angry. <laughs> um. Yeah, I know he's a bit odd, but apparently he did swindly as a member of the breeding club. I hear he can tame any animal and even manage to succeed at proliferating the endangered species. Rumor has it he can speak with animals. Well, that that's probably just a joke. Speak with animals? Well, he's certainly eccentric enough to not regard. I mean, there's no way a normal person would attempt to raise hamsters inside their own scarf. Uh, is that all? Oh. Pineapple. There's a pineapple there. Pineapple. Alright, yes, 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 yes. Okay, so poke the one. Boop, 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 boop. Report card. Alright. Gundam Tanaka. He was born on September 14th. He likes his four dark devas of destruction. And he dislikes earthly life. Yep. And then we got uh, Kazuichi Soda, who was born on June 29th. He likes Coke and he hates sugar free anything. Sugar free actually is, wait, even if you're a diabetic, uh, not the best thing to do because chemicals that make it sugar free aren't that good for you if you eat a lot so uh if anything if you want to doubt just do like the real thing you know there's your tip <laughs> um oh yeah Soraya where's yeah we have Sonia by the way uh Sonia the nice princess uh she likes the occult in Japan she also just likes sour plums <laughs> Oh, we've broken a last trick. Crimes. I mean, it was on his last legs, anyways. Mm. <laughs> Alright, so. Oh. Yeah, we did. We already did here, so I. Um. Oh, we didn't. Uh, she likes squishy, squishy. Uh. She just likes lectures and sour stuff. We didn't get a Kane. So it kind of likes. Fighting and meat, and she dislikes working hard. <laughs> I love Sonia. Sonia is adorable. She's like the best. I love her to death. Anyways, um, I think we can leave. Alright, um, we're walking. We're getting our steps in. Actually, we need to run. <laughs> I don't want this thing to go on too, too long. Whee! Rocket Punch Market. Please and thank you. Hmm. Ah, oh, yeah. So this is the supermarket. It's pretty big. If we're on a tropical island, does that mean we're, international we're in international waters? You're right. Thanks to this place, we won't need to worry about food and other necessities for a while. For a while? Wow. It's just a figure of speech. But there's no guarantee anything here is edible. What if this stuff is poisoned? What? Uh, you are certainly a skeptical type. Of course I am. Even the supermarket is strange. Look around. We're in a giant supermarket and there's nobody else here except us. 
Well, that can't be helped. Didn't Usami say this island is uninhabited? That's exactly my point. Ugh! What happened? It's nothing. <gasps> oh god. She's staring at me funny. Um, um, I, um, um, you know. I'm sorry. sorry. Why is she crying? Hajime. Bullying a girl. Not cool, Hajime. I didn't do anything. <laughs> uh, so your name's Hajime. If it's okay, may I please remember your name? Uh, of course, I don't mind you remembering it, but uh. My, my name is Mikan Sumiki. From the, from the bottom of my heart, I hope we can get along. <laughs> oh, Mikan. You're a little messed up, but you're still adorable. Well, you know. <laughs> um, 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 oh, my mind is drawing a blank from nervousness. And I went through all the topic of preparing 5,000 different discussion topics to discuss and during interactions. That seems excessive. <laughs> it's okay if you take your time and remember slowly. We'll wait as long as it takes. We'll wait for you forever if that's what it takes. Uh -huh. Huh? Is she- is he just putting more pressure on her? Well, I guess I'll ask you since I won't get it anywhere asking her, so... What's her deal? Ah, Beacon's the ultimate nurse. <sighs> Take it easy, Fedora. I'll reply to your thing as soon as I'm done with the stream, I promise. <laughs> um... Assuming I don't have to do anything next week, I think I'll be streaming this again if you guys want. It's either that or I swapped a portal, but if you guys want me to continue, so you can certainly do that. But yeah, I'll, I'll reply to the thing you tagged me in um, once the stream is done. Promise. Woo! Alright. Uh, this is your hydration reminder. Please hydrate if you haven't already. Get some water. <laughs> Please. This is your hydration reminder. Get your hydration up. <laughs> Take it easy, Fedora. Thank you for watching. Hydration reminder. Mm. <sighs> All right. Mm. That's good water. Good water. Best water. That's for hydration. Mm. So hopefully we can get through all of the instructions, and then I think I'll end the stream. So, cause you know, past ten I can't really talk. So we're gonna see how this goes. If you ever get injured, you'll need her help. So it's best you get along with her for now. If you get wounded and don't treat it, there's a good possibility you'll get an infection and die. Don't say something so morbid so naturally. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry for laughing so suddenly. <laughs> it's just, I can't help it. I'm so happy. I just can't remember the last time I made any friends. Oh, I'm so <laughs> sorry. Not that you two actually want to be my friends with me. I'm so sorry I said something so presumptuous. <laughs> Ariel, how's my Mekon voice? <laughs> Is my Mekon voice good? Hmm. <laughs> I don't think it's as close as mine. Oh my god. Himiko Yumeno! Voice. <laughs> Thank you. I'll do anything you say. Just please don't hate me. Man. Bling a girl. Not cool, Hajime. Seriously, why does this keep happening? <laughs> Here we go, you Mena, the ultimate mage. I'm officially called the ultimate magician. <laughs> That's one of the easiest ones I can do. Mm. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry. Jeez. Alright. At least we get to talk to a better girl. 
You should just do the massage technique. <laughs> it's not that hard to do. Uh, if I ever get V3 and play it on stream, I'll try and do that voice. I have the demo. The demo's existing. But guess what? Peeking! 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 Hello! Oh, hi! Who are you? Um, I'm Hajime Hinata. Hello! Hello? Your tension's super low. Are you feeling alright? Oh! Ah, that's right! Introduction to our gecko. E Buki Mio Sa! Put it together and what do you get? Ibuki Miyota! <laughs> oh, nice! I'm glad! <laughs> e Buki Mio Da! Put it together and what do you got? Get Ibuki Miyota! <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Bookie. Um, she's actually the ultimate musician, Soraya. Yes! Alright, introductions are finished. More importantly, check out this bombastic supermarket. I see. They got I hamburger, see. ramen, ramen noodles, chili beans, bratwurst, pasta. Ooh, melons! No problem! Americans, Chinese, Mexicans, Germans, Italians, and even people from Yubari would shop here. Yahoo! Man, I'm getting hella stoked. I'm 31 flavors of stoked for all this deliciousness. <sighs> what I excited? I get hungry and hungry. I don't understand myself. Why do I get hungry when I'm excited? Why do I get excited when I'm hungry? <laughs> the human body sure is a mystery. <laughs> Um, this energetic lady, young lady, is known as the ultimate musician. She used to play guitar in an all-girl band that was super popular with the other high school girls. Apparently, their hit single, After School, school Poyo, Poyo, Yon Hour, sold over a million copies. A super popular all-girl high school band. That sounds familiar. <laughs> I think Ibuki's supposed to be a reference to the anime, uh, Heian, I think? Or something? What? Due to creative differences, she left the band to pursue a solo career. Creative differences? Oh my my! Are you interested? Ugh, you can hear me? <laughs> Duh, Ibuki's a musician after all. Get like Schubert, Bach, Edison, Van Gogh, Frizz, and Senna. I too am a mouse musician. Oh, so you're saying you have good hearing. Well, wait, most of those people you weren't not musicians at all. <laughs> Don't sweat the details. I want to talk to her a little bit more. Get back to me. I see, I see. I see. There's cappuccino, darling tea, kid tea, green tea, yerba tea. Ooh, udon! <laughs> oh my gosh. How was that last one of food? Pointing! Ubana is a drink point. <laughs> I love Ibuki. She's the best. I love her to death. She she's one of my favorite characters of this game. That's a surfer. That said I'm not in the mood for water sports. That's one big cola bottle. I better go flat before you can even finish drinking it. I love Ibuki. She's, she's amazing. Whoops, wrong button. Alright, we gotta leave. Have we met everyone? No, we haven't. We have not. We still have... Okay, so I have to go back to the main island, because I haven't met with a Biyakia yet. And I think one other person? Get your steps in, boy. Alright. Uh, is it safe? <laughs> Alright, time to get to the Grand Island. Way. Get my steps in. One. How's that pet doing? Oh, despair meter. You should be having hope. Don't despair, please. Neopet doesn't need to despair. 
Alright, uh, Ikuki. She likes walking, napping, and gaming, and she hates boredom. I love you, Ikuki. Uh, we've met Fuyuhiko. Uh, we haven't met... Yeah, we just haven't met, um, Usami officially, and we haven't met Togami. Uh, where's... Where are you? Yeah, we met Fuyuhiko. Yeah. Where, where is Mikon? Where's Mikon? <laughs> she likes bathroom smells and she likes alcohol. She doesn't like oversized things. Yeah. Some of that makes me nervous. Get the steps in. Run, 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 run. Am I supposed to be here? I don't know how I'm supposed to be here. I... I could not tell you, Sarah. I could not tell you. No, that's the fourth island. We can't go here. Where am I supposed to be going? I think I have to go back to the first island, don't I? Ah. Oh no, this is where I'm supposed to go, I think. Yeah, probably. Not because she has some messed up past. Totally not. This is a park surrounded by the ocean. <laughs> I feel so nice. Such a laid back attitude. But if we were in a situation like this, I'd probably be enjoying some lazy staring uh myself. It being a keyword. How are your introductions going? I'd like to inform you about another feature. You may have already noticed, but you have a level assigned to you. It's displayed on the top right corner of your screen. Your level increases by performing various actions such as walking, examining, and talking to others. Every time you level up, you will become stronger than you were before. The number of skills you can equip will also increase, so please try your hardest to level up often. No, wrong button. F it says F1 was like your it's supposed to be your I have to Jesus. I don't have presents for you. I'm sorry. I can't give you a present yet. I don't have a present for you, my bun bun. I can just hope that um you won't despair. Alright. Hey, guess what? What do you want? What do you want? This guy's presence is overwhelming. He doesn't even seem very approachable. I mean, his body is overwhelming. Hey. Ah, Byakya. I have a time for a small introduction. Hmm. Introduction. <laughs> Come on, Hajime. Um, hello. My name is Hajime Hinata. My name is Byakuya Toga. <laughs> I'm done. That's it, right? Back off. I can tell this guy is thumbing his nose at me. Mm. Well, I suppose that's Byakuya that's for you. What do you mean? Actually... That guy is particularly special, even by ultimate standards. He's next in line to inherit his family's massive financial conglomerate. He's already begun managing the business operations, and his net worth is, well, enormous. How admirable. It's completely accurate to call him the uh, ultimate affluent prodigy. He's the epitome of exceptional. That's like a manga origin, origin story. <laughs> <laughs> you there. Hi, Jimmy, was it? Eh. Tell me, why did Hope's Peak Academy choose you? What is your ultimate talent? The, the thing is, I honestly can't remember. What? You don't remember? <laughs> Apparently, he lost his memory due to shock. He can't really remember much. Hmm, <laughs> how foolish. Um. Yes. I do believe we are finished talking. How much longer do you intend to stand there? Listen. Move along. There is only one thing these skinny types are good at, it seems. <laughs> Let's just leave Hajime. Yeah, sure thing. This building, that overwhelming aura of refinement just pushes people away. 
This is what it means to be the ultimate affluent prodigy? Whee! Was that the school bell just now? Huh? How'd you be look? That monitor over there. Congratulations, everyone! It appears that everyone has finished collecting the hope fragments. I'm... I'm so happy! So, I've prepared a present for everyone that'll make you all very happy! I apologize for the trouble, but please gather at the beach! <laughs> May Shining Hope be with you all! What to do? She said to me at the beach. Is that going to be okay? I'm starting to have a bad feeling about this. What? Thinking about just solve anything? We can do that after we go to the beach. Is that precaution really enough? To be honest, I'm really worried. But it would look bad if I was the only one who didn't go. <laughs> you're right, Ariel, you're right. <laughs> Oh god. Sorry, I have to use the quick transportation. There we go. I have to check on my pet. I keep wanting to check on my pet. Make sure you're not despairing. Alright. There we go. You guys are the last to arrive. What are you dilly dallying for? <laughs> Sorry to keep you all waiting. That's fine. Well, that's all right. More importantly, this is our only chance to talk between ourselves before that Robert returns. <laughs> yeah. Let's talk. Listen. Now then, let me hear your initial impressions of this island. Now that you mention, I happen to know as numerous blocked off bridges on the central island. Oh. Oh, and those are there so everyone doesn't get lost. I tried to cross one of them, and that rabbit showed up and told me, so I'm telling the truth! What? So we don't get lost? Is this island really that big? <laughs> Mike is a drop of brain salt. He's not wrong. But if you look at it in depth, it's just normal island, right? It's got the resorts and everything. I don't know what I'm doing for cause for Soto's voice. I don't know. I'm sorry. Also, there's a big range. Um, uh, there's also a large supermarket, too. It looks like it stocks everyone. Thing from food to living amenities. Hmm. The hotel is really nice, too. It'd be great if we could, get, if we could stay there. <laughs> the restaurant inside the hotel is also very nice. It seems to cater to m more plebeian taste. Hey. Can you guys listen to what I have to say, too? I found something very important on this island. <laughs> Girls, very cute girls, I'm all over the place. Gross, I can get goosebumps. Huh. All of you are fools. I can't believe nobody has mentioned the most serious truth. Huh? The most serious truth? Not possible. No one has realized it. You are bigger fools than I thought. Huh? I'm attempting. What'd you say? Don't be talking all big and stuff. Such ignorance. Small dogs shouldn't bark so loud. Oop. I'm doing my best. I am a single peep wearing out her voice for all this. Ooh. Oh, the most serious truth? What does he mean? Oh, sorry, Mike. I guess I gotta go talk to you. <laughs> He's so annoying. Yes, he is. <laughs> sorry, I love your statement. What's the most serious truth? Did you find out something about this island? Have you all gone to the park that's across the bridge? The park with that weird bronze statue and all those creepy animals, right? Listen. When I saw it, I remembered the story I heard before. There's an island on the Pacific Ocean, a beautiful island paradise where summer never ends. The coasts of a central island surrounded by five different islands. I also said the five holy animals symbolize each of those surrounding islands. Eh? Listen. 
<laughs> that island's name is Jabberwock Island. Could it be? Could this island be? Jabberwock Island? Is that the name of this place? This island? Very strange. Still, there is something on my mind. In fact, according to what I've heard, Jabberwock Island is already. Hmm. Never mind. Hold on! Hold it right there! You got that's a rather incomplete story you told us. Don't worry. No need to shout, I'll let you know once I obtain more information. Yeah, uh. I don't care what's on this what's the island called? Neonico Island or Papua Island Papua? Papu? <laughs> Papu fruit <laughs> Doesn't change the fact that we all gotta live here, right? Yeah, Living together on this tropical island sure is exciting. I'm sure looking forward to it. Right on. This ain't so a bad school after all. Hey, you guys? I like it. Hmm. I like this island too. Hmm. Can't say the same about the rest of you, Greenins. Uh huh? Did I hear something? Hmm. I'm still worried. But I don't feel as worried as I did earlier. <laughs> yeah, since there's no danger or inconvenience, I feel like this won't be a problem. Hey, listen to what you guys are saying. We need to stay calm and think about this. We're all here to attend Hope Seek Academy, right? But we're living on some island like this instead. No matter what, it's completely weird. Why don't you stop talking for a while? Go cool your head off or something. Huh? To tell you the truth. Plus, if you even want to leave, there's no way we can. <laughs> there's no ship, no planes, and planes are just for show. It appears. From what I've discovered, there is no way to contact the outside world either. In conclusion, it would be impossible to call for help. Um... Then why don't we just swim home? It's impossible! <gasps> There's no way we could swim that far! Show some spirit! What? Are you I'm stupid? I'm telling you, it's impossible! And what if we cut down some trees and meet a raft? I won't let you! Uh huh I can't. You can't do that! That's the biggest of nettles! Got it? Please recall the guidelines of the school trip! Littering is not allowed. Let's coexist with this island's bountiful nature and mutual prosperity. Got it? I want everyone to get along and, peace and live peacefully on this beautiful tropical island. What's with these rules? Who cares about that? That's enough. Stop. This rabbit seems to be very finicky about these so-called rules. Based on that, what if your action placed everyone actions place everyone here in danger. Oh, uh, the word danger is a bit much. I would, wouldn't do something like that. Hajime. Hajime, I know how you feel, but you need to calm down a little, okay? For now. As long as we don't do anything weird, it seems there is no danger. Yep. As long as we gather the hope fragments, we'll be able to get off the island soon. You're all just gonna believe that? <laughs> there is no other choice but to believe it for now, that is. Hey, hey! Anyway, Yusami, what's this present you mentioned in the announcement earlier? Love! Huh, that's right! Well, of course I didn't forget. My love! This is it! Don't be upset, I prepared one for you all, so don't worry! What is this? <laughs> it's an Yusami strap! If you squeeze tummy, you talk! I'm Yusami! Magical miracle girl, Yusami! I'm an itty bitty girl who's sweet like milk! <laughs> Isn't it cute? Love, love. What a waste of time. Aww. Man, I got my hopes up too. I'm ashamed I even had my hopes up. Do you think so? Really? I think it's very cute, especially how the ears look like a rabbit's. Oh, Sami does mean rabbit, you know. Regardless, a large number of Usami straps ended up on the beach anyway. As I figured, after everyone received their straps, they just trussed them onto the beach. You can't take nature with trash. <laughs> See, even you think they're trash. Usami sadly picked up the straps and looked at us with a lonely expression on her face. <laughs> oh, you even prepared one more present too, but now I don't want to give it to you, bad kids. Could it be? Mm -hmm. You have something else? Um, well, compared to the Usami straps, it's not that big of a deal. Basically, I prepared a motive for everyone. A motive? Hey! That's right! A motive for everyone to get along! We come all this way to a tropical island, so I thought it'd be great to do something island themed. <laughs> like what? Are you thinking of throwing a big party or something? Ding, ding, ding. Correct! Wow! Is it a festival? 
Our miniature shrine? How wonderful! Anyway... Excuse me, Masona. <laughs> um, no, wait! <laughs> Adios, goodbye. Oh god, what did I... <laughs> they really just saw what you posted in, in uh, the Discord chat. Thank you, Griffin. Thank you, Griffin, very much. Knock it off, Terra Terra. Oh, oh your tenderloins? You betcha. <laughs> Just ignore him, Sonya. I got it! If we're talking about fun parties on a tropical island, maybe it should be a barbecue or something. Oh, oh a campfire sounds nice. T sounds fun, too. Let's kill! Let's find a hoop sinky. Kill it! You serious? Is that looking for one not enough for you? I see. It seems everyone has different ideas, but if we're going... We gotta be at the ocean then first. Ta -da! Ta -da! This is what we're all about. This is a swimming back. Correct. Whoa! Whoa, that, that means. Ta -da! That's right. I have swim suits for everyone. Well, school swimsuits actually. I hope that's okay. Are you telling us to go swimming in a situation like this? Yes. <laughs> it's not like I'm ordering you guys to swim or anything. It's just if you want to go swim, you can. There's no way I'm going swimming. Oh, sorry, that, that there's no way I'm going swimming. There's no way anyone would be so thoughtless as to go swimming in a situation like this. Yeah! Eh? That's right! Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. With weather this nice, there's no way I'm gonna pass on swimming. I agree. <laughs> Get away. Right. Your tender ones? I don't understand. Wait! Seriously, don't try to understand. How long has it been since I last swam in the sea? All right, let's get changed. Those of us who were excited to go swimming went to get their swimsuits from Yusami and right straight to the hotel to change. Hey. What are you gonna do, Hajime? Hajime. I understand how you feel, and I won't force you to do anything you don't want to do. <laughs> hmm. But if you feel up for it, I'd be happy if you came along too. Oh my God, no voice. Oh my god, my voice. My poor voice. Give me a second to recover for a moment. Ugh. I appreciate doing this, but my voice can't do scratchy much, so give me a second. Ooh. Uh, no lace replied soon. Is this a good stopping point, Ariel? I forgot. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I think... Yeah, maybe we should. <laughs> We've been going for almost three hours. Jeez. Yeah, maybe that is a good idea. I can reply to some of the stuff I was going on. Ah, well, let me. Oh, hold on a second. After he said that, Nagito ran over to the hotel as well. There is no danger on this island. There's nothing tragic going to happen on this island. Is that really true? Oh, yeah. Yeah. If so, am I actually wrong? Hmm. <laughs> Yakya. You're not gonna swim, Yakya? Of course not. That's enough. However, don't think that makes us friends or anything. Our reasons couldn't be more different. Different reasons? <laughs> you cannot accept our situation because you're nothing but a coward, right? Coward? What? That Usami thing is not lying to us. Eh. Oh. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> yeah, it's it's because I have so many voices to do too. You're starting to realize that, aren't you? Then why aren't you going to swim? I simply don't like ocean water, it's too salty. <laughs> Alright, um... Let's see. Alright, yada yada. 
I'm just gonna talk to the rest. I'm not gonna dialogue. Sleepy. <laughs> okay, here we go. I saw a group of people wearing swimsuits jumping into the ocean, shouting with joy. Okay, so this is where I can take a break from my voice. The sea! Uh, the water is so cool! It feels great! Oh, too salty! This water's too salty! It's not going easy on me! Hey, I got some suntan lotion from the supermarket. Would anyone <laughs> like a rub down? Oh, you're quite considerate. Now then, will you apply it right away? Hey? Rubbing lotion on a muscular <laughs> ninja. All right, no problem. My tastes are pretty open, you know. <laughs> you seem a little too open. I think like you're covering too many bases by yourself. Is this ship? I can't remember what specific <laughs> key. <laughs> I'll make sure to slather you with lots and lots of oil. <laughs> what is this feeling of intense bloodlust? <laughs> it feels like a resort. There's no other way to describe it. <clears throat> Seeing the other students having all this fun. I... <laughs> yep, yep, I'm very happy. Everyone seems to be getting along with each other, so I'm very happy. I thought this would be hard until everyone got used to this, but they're all acting like ultimates. Hmm. Ding, 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 ding. Let's keep up the pace and do all our best and enjoy this heart dabbing school trip. Mm. What's this feeling of alienation? I can't really put it into words. Am I really wrong about all of this? Fine. I just gotta do it, right? Then I'll do it. That's right, I'll do it. Huh? Hachime? Did you say did something happen? Hey, hand me one of those swimsuits. Jeez, I can't believe I was the only one worrying. I feel like an idiot. I don't care anymore. I'm gonna go for it. Me rolling on Genshin. I'm gonna seriously enjoy myself and have fun. <laughs> Why was this, you know? Hey, you guys! Don't forget about me! Hey, hey, wait for me! Let me join in the fun! <laughs> wait, huh? What? Oh! Suddenly, the sky grew cloudy. Huh? What is this? What's happening? These strange clouds. This doesn't look natural at all. Hmm? Huh? Oh. Hey, oh, what's going on? What did you do? This is obviously not right. It was sunny just a few moments ago. <laughs> Ain't that a mood, Ariel? Hey! What is this? Huh? I didn't do anything! What is all of this? There's no way! Something like this shouldn't be happening now! In at a, that exact moment... That's when all it seemed like it couldn't get more confusing. It suddenly happened. Boop 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 boop! Ah uh, ah! Uh, mic check! Mic check! <laughs> uh, Oh, I'm gonna me? stop, yeah. Can I'm gonna stop me? after this cutscene. My voice was so laid back and so gleeful that it seemed out of place. But it was different than Usami's. As if an endless storm of malice could be felt raging behind that laid back voice. That moment I felt it, my body shuddered. <laughs> Surprise? You were totally surprised! Right? <laughs> Sorry to keep you all waiting for so long. Let's leave all this worthless entertainment behind. It's time for the main attraction. You guys better hustle over to Jabberwock Park. Pudi, this voice. If it is, oh, this is bad. I gotta do something. I won't let you. It's all up to me. Hey, wait. Very strange. It seems that was an unusual occurrence. Hmm. It's best if we go too. 
Chippewa Park, was it? Let's hurry. Hey! Wait! But what about everyone else who's swimming? Naturally. There's no time to wait for them to change. I have a bad feeling about this. I'll head over first. What the hell's going on? I'll be really pissed if it's something stupid. What is this? What the hell's going on? Okay, Jabbawa Park, right? Alright, so we're gonna save here. Because it is. this has been killer on my voice. Uh, where, where is my... Oh, we didn't even get to look at Togami's report card, did we? Um, he likes coffee and he hates commoners. His birthday is May 5th. Huh! May the 5th. Return to the 5th. <laughs> oh, did we... Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, how's my pet doing? You are okay for now. You got that. So... I'm going to save. Did I save? Yes. Yes, I wish to override. Okay. So, alright. Um, no. One. I'd like to quit. Yes. Alright. So. That was Danganronpa. Two, the prologue. We're not done yet with the prologue. But seeing as we've been almost going for three hours, and my voice can only take as much as it can, I'm gonna stop here for the advice of everybody and your suggestions. So yeah. So don't worry, we will be uh we will probably be playing this next week if that's what you guys wish to see. Um mm, yeah. <laughs> So, what are your thoughts? Who do you think that- I mean, Ariel knows who the mysterious figure is. I know who the mysterious figure is. I'm going to turn down the music a bit. But yeah. Ooky spooky. <laughs> boop 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 boop! <laughs> but in the meantime, um, tomorrow I will be guest starring on- <laughs> No, um, in the meantime, tomorrow I will be guesting on Sal's stream to talk about um, episode 8 of, uh, The World Ends With You, the animation. Um, I'll be handling that and the like. Um, and yeah, so hopefully next week we'll be able to continue this. And I will bring a lot more water this time. <laughs> or at least try not to strain my voice as much. The good thing is that as we go for the game, the less voices I have to do. <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so wow <laughs> I can't go believe laugh it's it's late I'm gonna get poked at that's the one I... oh Soraya I would recommend looking up a no commentary playthrough of Dang and Rumpel one for now. Oh god, my poor... Oh, starting Oh no, my poor SK8 logo. I just realized I gotta fix this now. Because I changed it. I changed the text. There we go. Yes. Yeah, that, that that's a good idea. Because I don't think I'll be able to play it at my channel at the moment. Um, yeah, it is a good... Yes. But for now, uh, thank you all for watching. Um, remember, hit the follow button and the notification button to see when I go live. I normally go live at 6.30 p.m. EST. Um, sometimes a bit later, depending on how fast I can eat food. But yeah, so um, make sure to follow the Twitter at SK8 Productions. Um, you know, SK8 Productions. I post when I go live. And all that fun stuff. Um, I also post um, content and stuff whenever I upload. 
uh, go subscribe to the YouTube channel. That is uh, Super Kate Productions, same as this. Uh, I upload every month, at least attempt to. So, um, yeah. Thank you all for watching, and stay awesome, really universe. Travel to alternate dimensions, and uh, maybe go vibe on an island. It feels like that kind of weather. <laughs> Bye!